What's good? It's Chigozi. It's Monday, March 4th, 2019. Luke Perry has been murdered by CBS Television Studios, the Zionist Jew producers, giving you 90210, Riverdale. Those are the two government films he's acted in, two TV series from the federal government. And since he acted in those, he was murdered by the numbers as they murder all of their employees. And you have to understand when I say that, keep in mind they could be faking their deaths, you know, changing their identities, moving somewhere else or whatnot. But this gang's very sick. This murder by numbers ritual they've been playing for centuries, millennia. And here's just another example of how they do it. So when Luke Perry had a stroke, that was 20 weeks from his birthday. 20, a number connected to death. Luke Perry, born October 11th, 1966. So from his 52nd birthday till his stroke on 227, You will see that. You see, see how it is 19 weeks and 6 days. So when you count the end date, it is 20 weeks. Also notice how it was 139 days. 139 is the 34th prime. Here he's dying on 3 slash 4. A murder ritual classic from the government. You can tell because it's on 3 slash 4. Murder equals 34. Killing equals 43. In other parts of the world, they write it 4 slash 3. So here you take the alphabetical order. K is the 11th letter. I is the 9th. 1 plus 1 is 2. I remains 9. L becomes 3 because 1 plus 2 is 3. You do all that for killing, you get 38. Death, 38. Murder, 38. So they put these 38s, these 34s, these specific numbers, in these murder rituals. The particular one today is 3443. It is murdered by numbers. And again, 139 is the 34th prime. He dies 139 days. Or he got a stroke 139 days from his birthday. Remember, he's born October 11th, 1966. A date with 8825 numerology. And a date with a lifeless number of 43. And he dies 4 slash 3. Killing 43. Masonic 43. 8825, those are the numbers for stroke. So that's why he had a stroke, 8825. Also notice how stroke has this 38 number. Killing 74, 38, death 25. Who's giving you these medical terms? The Zionist Jews, the Freemasons. The Jesuit order, this is their propaganda. They're murdering these people by this numerical system. And I'm showing you right here. Death equals 52 as well in Gamatria. He's dying at 52 years old. According to Wikipedia, Luke Perry died from complications of a stroke. Complications of a stroke equals 97. That's the 25th prime. So you got to keep your, mo your eye on these numbers for death and killing. That's what they like to use and sacrifice. Today, March 4th, a date with 46 numerology. Sacrifice equals 46, kill 26, chaos 19, Fred Andrews equals 63. He played Fred Andrews in Riverdale. So they're murdering Fred Andrews, Archie's dad, on the 63rd day of the year. This is how the Zionist Jews do it. 63 forwards and backwards. Because S is the 19th letter, 1 plus 9 is 10. So reducing S only once. You get 63 when you add them all. Reversing that vocal order, reducing each letter to single digit, 63. You see what I'm saying? 63rd day of the year. Coy Luther Perry the third, 97. 97 to 25th prime. The complications of a stroke.
See, complications of a stroke. He was an actor for the federal government, just like John Adams. This is another Freemason, an actor for the Freemasons, the federal government. The American Revolution was by the numbers. I'm showing you this so you can afterwards apply this to his life. See how many days he died from his birthday. See what date numerology he died on. See the American Revolution, the days it started, the day it died, how long, or the day it ended, how long it lasted. You see the same coding. So, from Luke Perry's 52nd birthday till today is 144 days. You know that big killing number? 144. We see this number in death routinely all the time. It's with that 10 days later riddle with the 144. Also a span of 20 weeks and 5 days when you count the end date, another 25. Death 25. 20. Again, got a stroke 20 weeks from his birthday. And now he's dying. 20 weeks and 5. You count the end date. But without counting the end date, it's 144. Kill equals 44. When you write out 44, you get 144. Connecting through time. And pi in circles. Time 144. Pi equals 69, the Jewish cipher. That's also interesting. Saturn equals 69. But time equals 144. The first 144 decimals of pi equals 666. Also connected with time and prophecy. You know, the beast ruling for 42 months. That's the number of the beast. The beast representing time. And From the day he died to his upcoming 53rd birthday, 53 is the 16th prime number, pi equals 16. So he's, he's going to turn 53 this coming October, the 16th prime. We even get 31 weeks and 4 days, 3.14 like pi. And remember, two things. When you write out, when you write out 22 divided by 7, just using that little order, you get 314. If you do 22 divided by 7, you get 3.14285714286. You can just round that to two decimal places, 3.14. It's an approximation of pi. And when did he get his stroke? On February... 27th. You see what I'm saying? You just take the slash, move it over to the left. That's the date he got his stroke. February 27th. And it was 227 days from his upcoming 53rd birthday. 227, the 49th prime. Luke Perry equals 47. Or 49, excuse me. Luke Perry equals 49. Riverdale equals 49. 227 is the 49th prime number. So we see all this 227 is active. 227 days from his birthday, he gets the stroke. When you count the end date, it's a span of 227 days. You know, the skull and bones, 322. When you're out 226, you get 93, Saturn 93. But 227 days, that's the 49th prime. He was in Riverdale, 49. His name is Luke Perry, 49. We just had the Prodigy guy dying. I don't know if his name. Yeah, Prodigy, 49. See, he died today as well on 3 slash 4. I'll link Zachary Get Hubbard's videos we put out about this and Luke Perry. You can see I got, I got a couple of this, these pieces of information from his video I watched. And you see how the riddle's working out. And they, and they quote Massive Stroke. I like how he also pointed this out in his video. Massive equals 43. TMZ was even emphasizing Massive. He's dying 4 slash 3 after a Massive Stroke. Massive also equals 8825, like stroke, and he dies, in a, and he was born, excuse me, he was born a day with 88, 
25 numerology. Remember, October 11th, 1966. Date with 88, 25 numerology, massive 88, 25, stroke 88, 25. You see how this all flows together? Stroke also equals 34, and he's dying 3 slash 4. March 4th. Guys, Luke Perry was murdered by the federal government. I don't know what else to tell you. Again, and if he wasn't, yeah, even if he faked his death, by murder, I mean his persona, his character. So, you know, his, if his body's flesh and blood is actually fine or not, that's beyond the scope of this research, at least for what I'm doing. But am I, t am I telling you that this is an inorganic death, that he didn't really have a, I mean, I don't even think he had a, really had a stroke. You see how stroke syncs up with his, I mean, but don't get me wrong, guys, the Zionist Jews def definitely have the technology to probably induce a stroke or something. So before we wrap this up, I know he was more known with for Beverly Hills 90210. So we'll look a bit at that. Just to finish this off. But I hope you get it. I showed you the 227 ritual. Connected him in Riverdale. Stroke on 227, 227 days from his birthday. Died 314 from his birthday as well. He's going to be 53, the 16th prime, Pi 16. Even his last name, P, the 16th letter. So Dylan McKay is who he's known for the most. I know Dylan has that killing number as well. Dylan equals 20 like death. Remember, 20 weeks from his birthday, he's getting the stroke. Death 79, death 20. It's the numbers for death all inside this piece of propaganda. It's 97, 25, 20 like Dylan. McKay, 17 like kill, 53, the 16th prime. Just talking all about that. Kill 28, 444 like Masonic, like killing. All these 74 words in the English Sumerian cipher, some do 444. That is why Jay-Z had his 444 album. Jay-Z is a 33rd degree Prince Hall Freemason. I also think he's a Scottish Rite Freemason. And he loves to participate in all this propaganda. Dylan McKay equals 37. Luke Perry, L is the 12th letter, 1 plus 2 is 3. Perry, P is the 16th letter, 1 plus 6 is 7. LP 37 Lincoln Park when Chester Benton died that was all a number 37 ritual as well Dylan McKay also equals 53 another 53 the 16th prime I also love how Dylan McKay was murdered for the Super Bowl that just passed the 99th season for the Patriots 53 37 I'll speak of the devil the Freemasons driving by honking their horn their siren making noise this is their propaganda right here. They're probably carrying out some more false flags in the state of Ohio like they do all the time. Patriots 37, 53, also equals 49, like Super Bowl. 490 in Jewish, but when I say 49, understand, you can drop the zero in numerology. And that is what the Jewish bankers do, the Kabbalists who code this propaganda. These are false Jews. This is how they operate. I can't help but understand this 90210 being 9 and 21. Beverly Hills 90210, Sun 9, Saturn 21, all in the full reduction, 90210. See how they space it out? And Beverly Hills has that zip code for a reason. It is a Saturnian run place from the Freemasons. You know, Beverly 35, like the Lima. <laughs> Hills 30, like Saturn. See what I'm saying? So easy to see. Saturn 42, the reflection of 24. It's not a coincidence. I knew it was going to do this. You can just tell by the error code. It was Sacrifice 67. That's why the Beverly Hills guy also, 67 to 19 prime in 2019 dying. Blood Sacrifice 86, 67, kill 59, Freemason 59. Philema 35, 149, the 35th prime. 
Kill 28, Beast of Second Letter, H is to 8, Thelema 28, 2, 8. See what I'm saying? It's a Thelemic ritual. The whole show is the Thelemic ritual from the federal government. I've never even seen the show, but I can tell you right now, it is. It originally aired October 4th, 1990. It was 33 numerology. 24 numerology day with 88 days remaining, like stroke 88. Like how we get this number still here too. 277, the 59th prime. Are you seeing this? Beverly Hills 59, the 59th prime is the day of the year it comes out. I mean, guys, the Zionist Jews, the Freemasons, they put out this stuff. They use this code to put out your entertainment. Why do you think I can just randomly find out the day that this came out and show you clearly what they're doing? You know, 1990, 1990, 46 Prime, Conspiracy 1, 2, 3. America also found a date with 104 Numerology. Beverly Hills 90210 equals... Been seeing a lot of 161s, you know, 187, the murder number. We all know about this number in death. Death also equals 79. Excuse me, murder equals 79, death 97. And 71, the 20th prime. And again, he's dying, or he got the stroke 20 weeks from his birthday. How many 20s have we seen in this prophet again? So I'll close it there. Hope you enjoyed this video. Oh, here's, here's a good thing. I guarantee you this under observation would have this death, killing, murder, sacrifice coding foreshadowing his death. They're saying Luke Perry hospitalized, which that has this 144 coding as well. That's why with Carrie Fisher being hospitalized, I knew she was going to be sacrificed as well based on the coding inside her prop again. And they took my channel down, so I don't have that anymore. But you can go back and look at Carrie Fisher prop again and see. Under observation. That's going to be coded as well. Under observation. 76, see? Blood sacrifice 76. And they're putting that right here inside this prop again. Blood sacrifice 76. That's why I said he's under observation. You get what I'm trying to say. You can see their main blood sacrifice numbers inside this prop again all the time. Never fails. So, and again, they're saying massive stroke, massive 43. So keep this, keep that in mind. Take care. Peace out.